Africa's problem is largely corruption, lack of good governance, lack of proper policy making and implementation, these are the biggest challenge the continent faces. Corruption is one of the biggest challenge Africa is facing, corruption has spread widely to the way of life in majority of Africa, it has permeated all life facets like access to medical care, jobs, use of public resources, misappropriation of public funds, inequality in access of service from government offices and so on. Poor governance is another problem Africa is facing, many African countries are facing a struggle of getting proper democratic governance, in most African countries, political leaders have found ways to influence the electoral process, from increasing term limits, to sabotaging the opposition parties and leaders, along with civil societies. Another problem with Africa is population growth. Africa has some of the highest population growth in the world, the Isridge world fertility rate is 2 to 5 children per woman, in Africa it is 4 to 7 children per woman, this alone is a huge challenge now and years to come, the current population of the continent is 1.2 billion, up from just a half million people in 1980, the UN projects that by 2050, the annual growth of the continent will increase by 42 million, contributing 54% of the of the overall world population by 2050. Another problem with Africa is insecurity, insecurity is common in Africa, slowing down progress at all levels from internal crime, to terrorists groups, to civil war, and political instability. Another problem with Africa is poverty, it is widely believed that Africa is a poor continent, if that's true, why then did the colonist go there? African countries have some of the most valuable natural resources that forms raw materials for the industries responsible for the growth of the developed world, yet people living in Africa are poor. Another problem with Africa is ignorance, lack of knowledge is one of the major problems of Africa, leaders in Africa have not understood the principles that govern the destination of a people, where knowledge lacks, people perish, today. I want to conclude that Africa is poor because of its leaders. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, see you next time, bye for now.